Who's Chad Kelly? Yes, Jeff sir! This is Fan First Network. What did you guys see in the last five minutes? What changed? What changed? It was good. The boys battled hard. They kept going up and down. Once they got those field goals, you already know the game was done. Great comeback by the Argos, man. Great comeback. Dukes was all the way. Dukes is better than Kelly. Let's go, Argos! Hey, you heard it here first. Dukes is better than Kelly. We had, we had intensity. We had a tight game. We had real Canadian football at its best. Every clicking moment creeping. A lead was gone. Plays were made. It was real, genuine Canadian football at its best. Yes, sir. We're back, right? We're back. Who's Chad Kelly? Yes, Cameron sir! All the way. Cameron Dukes is looking real good out there. The Argos D-line as always are looking sharp, you know what I mean? So it's looking nice. Special teams units new, and they're looking like they're coming together game one already, so you know. How do you guys think this season is going to go for the Argos? How do you guys think, think this season is going to go home with the Grey Cup? Grey Cup all the way. Very confident. We got a lot of new players on our team. Hopefully we can pull it out. Let's win it all, baby. Let's go, Argos! We got a lot of speed, a lot of new players. We got our quarterbacks ready and ready to go. Let's go, on go! British Columbia lost with a backup quarterback. So we get Chad Kelly, all this momentum going forward. I am positive that we can win the Grey Cup, win the East, because, oh, I'm looking for our competition in the Eastern Division. I'm not really quite seeing it. Oh, I think there's a smidgen called Ottawa and Hamilton right there, but he can just kick that aside. I'm not worried. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. <laughs> I'm not worried at all. I got faith in my Toronto Argonauts, as should you. I could see us being fucking 14 wins this season, making it fucking Eastern Finals Conference again, and even if we're playing Montreal, shit, same shit's not happening again this year. 100%. Yeah, 100%? 100%. It's early, but they're my team. So yeah, I'm, I'm with through them. And through. Absolutely. Through Absolutely. And through. All I know? Our backup QB did the work and we got it done and, you know, we're looking like contenders right off the rip. Dukes looked amazing tonight, man. He was uh, throwing the ball, fucking complete dots, and everyone was hating on him before this game, especially these Hamilton fans. And he, he, Hamilton just, he just showed out tonight, especially with his defense and everything. It was amazing. Yeah, what do you think? I think Dukes did fucking amazing, but we got to work on that running game. Our O-line yeah. needs to work on their shit a little bit, but overall our throwing game is, like, Amazing. Dukes, McManus, McManus with a big stop on that quarterback, and Brickman. That D-line just ate breakfast, dinner, lunch, and brunch right on the offensive. And there you go. He put Kentucky on the map, right? Yeah. I think they were guarding pretty good, you know, reading the plays, and I thought they made some big hits. Brandon McManus did a lot on defense for us, got a lot of tackles, a lot of clutch plays. I really think he was the guy tonight. I agree, I agree. What yeah, about McManus and Brinkman. Brinkman with the three sacks at the end of the game in the fourth, that was clutch, that was big Amazing. for us. Cameron Dukes, like yeah, I liked 100%. him last year and, and watching him play there. And of course, Royce Menchie, always, always uh, an ace on special sure, teams. 100%. Yep. What would you give up or what would you do to end up with one of these at the end of the season? Oh man, like, okay. Like, it, it depends, like, what would you do for? What would you die for? And I'm going wrong. I love my dad, I love my mama, I love everything. But would I die for my mama and my papa? No, no, no. Would I die for the Argos? Oh, yeah, I'd die for the Argos. <laughs> I don't know, my left leg? To be honest, I'll, I'll give up my left leg. This is Fan First Network. <laughs>